Hello guys, so a long time ago I made a list of the whole of Film Francis' tier list, and we went over exactly the same one. But have I seen any new Francis since then? And we're gonna see if there are any new. We're gonna see how many film Francis are on here. So we'll be ranking them from the best to the worst. And also, I've not seen. I still have not seen all of these movies. But if I've seen at least one movie in the franchise, this, this, then it should count. So, if I haven't seen a single movie in one of these franchises, I'll just put them in the NA section. So, first is The Godfather. The Godfather is an amazing franchise. I, I have only seen the first two, but both of those movies were amazing, so I can put them in the S tier. Mar Next is the Marvel Cinematic Universe. This is Marvel Studios. We're going to say at the, at the Marvel Cinematic Universe, so... Where do I put Marvel? Okay, it's not it's not any of these here, because most Marvel movies are around... Out here or higher, except for Captain Marvel. Captain Marvel's down here, but you know, even some of the worst Marvel movies, like you know, Black Panther, one of my least favorites, Ant Man and the Wasp, For the Dark World, those are examples of Marvel movies that are just not that good. Probably won't go back to them that much as others, but even then, they're still in this CTO quality. And of course, yeah, I can put Marvel in STL. I don't care what people say, but you know, uh, people say put in STL. Next is John Wick. John Wick is an amazing franchise. It is an amazing franchise. Okay, Disney Animation Studios. This is the... I think this is classic Disney, not modern Disney. I'll put Disney around... Okay, I'm not going to put my biases towards modern Disney. Oh, type of classic Disney animated movies? Yeah, Disney will be an ATL. They have made a lot of classic movies that say it's mine and many other childhoods, so... Next is Harry Potter, not my favorite franchise in the world. I've seen like the first four movies and the Fantastic Beasts movies and that's it. I'm going to put it in C tier. It's not my favorite movie in the series. Next franchise in the world. Next is Spider-Man trilogy. Well, Spider-Man 3 is okay. 1 was good and 2 was good. So I'm going to put it in B tier. 3 was kind of like that one movie that brings it down a lot. Night of the Museum, the movies. Yeah, the first one was pretty good and the other ones just this, exist. So I'm going to put it in C tier. Tier. Next is The Hobbit. The Hobbit were, pretty, were all pretty good movies. Tier. B tier. Resident Evil. I have not seen any of the Resident Evil movies. Star Wars. Okay. The original trilogy are, good, are great. I'm not going to put Star Wars in S tier because the sequel trilogy does exist. You know. Last Jedi exists. <laughs> you know. You know. It, that, and so a Star Wars story exists. The stains on the Star Wars franchise. The sequel trilogy. So. Gonna put it in A tier because the stains called the sequel to it. Back to the Future also in A tier. First movie will be good, second movie uh, and third movie are good, so I'm gonna put them in A tier. Anania, yeah, I didn't really care for Narnia, so D tier. Toy Story, all three movies are good, so A tier. I've not seen the fourth one, I'm probably seeing the fourth one. Missing Parts, but I've seen Missing Parts before, and that's the only one I've seen, so I'm gonna put it in A tier. James Bond, I've not seen, I've not seen a single James Bond movie. I don't want to dive, dive into 25 or 40 movies. I know, I like, MCU, yes. MCU has that man, has the same amount of movies as well. But James Bond has, like, 30, 40 movies over the years. X-Men, well, the X-Men, yeah. Dark Phoenix was horrible. Deadpool is great, so I'm going to put... Yeah, Deadpool is a part of the X-Men franchise. Apocalypse, horrible. And, you know, New Mutants, don't want to see, but will probably be horrible. But I'll probably, have to, I'll probably see it anyways. Some of the older ones, like the Wolverine ones, Rogan was pretty good. You know, some of the older ones are pretty good. So I'm going to put in B tier. Meet the Fockers. That's a franchise? Rocky? Yeah, Rocky goes in S tier. Rocky 1 was good. Rocky. The first four movies are good. Creed 1 and 2 are good. The only bad movie in the franchise is Rocky 5. But all of the other movies are all excellent. Next to The Dark Knight goes in S tier. It's, more, it's another pretty amazing trilogy. You know, same thing with War of the Rings as well. Hangover, never seen a single movie in that franchise. Kung Fu Panda's pretty good. So, B tier. Nightmare on Elm Street, that's a horror franchise. I don't watch horror movies that much. The Mummy. Hunger Games is pretty good. Put it A tier. Don't know what movie, don't know what this is. It's like so zoomed in, I can't even see it. So, sorry, whatever franchise it is. <laughs> can't, don't really know what it is, so. Rambo. Yeah, Rambo's A tier. Pretty good franchise. Next is Godzilla. Well, God, I think they have Godzilla and Monsterverse as a franchise. Godzilla is pretty good. ATL. 
pretty fun, pretty good. Might as well make the Monster Force, which is way down here. You know, saying, you know, Monster Force is basically just Godzilla mostly. Die Hard? I've seen the first one. First one's pretty good. That's very recently. I don't know if I'll see the sequels or not, but this one, it was pretty good. Alien, well, the problem with Alien is they have two really good movies, and the rest of the movies are just garbage, okay? Alien is just one of those weird franchises. They can put in B tier. The first two movies are just masterclass of movies, and it's like Zars. It's just, it's, they're, all the rest of them just suck. The only one that I actually liked was the first two Aliens and Alien vs. Predator. Those are the only ones I liked in the entire franchise. And Alien Resurrection is okay. Okay, Prometheus is complete garbage. Requiem is complete garbage. Alien vs. Predator, Requiem. Alien 3 is complete garbage, okay? You know, Alien Covenant is complete garbage as well. So, B tier. Twilight, yeah, F tier. Socknado is a Socknado. How? Socknado? We all know we're going to give it an S tier, but it's just Socknado. How could you... How could you not hate Sharknado? Sharknado is Sharknado Transformers. Okay, this is one of the most. It's not my least favorite franchise in the world. Bone B was pretty good. Transformers One was pretty good. The third movie was okay. The second movie was bad. Was bad. The fourth movie, I seen bits of it, pieces of it. I'm gonna put it in D tier. Next is How to Train a Dragon. All three of the movies are pretty good. I think they are, you know, here Star Trek I have not seen a single Star Trek movie. Shrek. Oh, uh, it's... Okay, I'm not gonna... Okay, I'll stop giving Shrek S tier for the memes, okay? i seen all the Shrek... i seen, like, the first three Shrek movies. The, the first one's good. The second... The first... Second and third one are... Eh. So the C tier. The Matrix... Yeah, A tier. The third movie was... It was kind of like Spider-Man. The third movie was... The third movie was not that great, but... The first two were pretty amazing. Avatar... That's not really a franchise. I, I didn't... Avatar was really forgivable anyway, so D tier. Okay, I think this is... Okay, so it's Captain America and Batman here. You know. This is not even. This is just move. This is not even a franchise. Okay, this is not even a franchise. Batman. So it's James Bond and Captain America. Friday Fourteenth. Van Black One and Two. One was good. Was amazing. Two was okay. And then Man, International. We all know that movie. That movie doesn't even exist. So gonna go and BTL. Fast and the Furious. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I already made my grievances of why I hate the Fast and the Furious franchise. They're all the same movies. Again, you can say about some of these other franchises like Marvel and Rocky. Oh, they're all the same movies. But Fast and the Furious is just... They release them like every two years. You know, make billion dollars. And that's all they are. That's all Fast and Furious is. Jason Bourne, it's okay. I have not seen all of them. But it's BTL. The first movie is good. Tony. Tony 1, again, Tony 1, 2, 3 are actually good. Good, but the rest of them the suck. So I'm gonna put Tony in ATL. You know, Mad Max. I've not seen the Mad Max movie. Ice Age. I like all the Ice Age movies. I'm not one of those people who hate the sequels. I I think they're all funny and entertaining movies. So I'm gonna put Ice Age in ATL. Underworld is just an okay franchise. It's CTL. Ocean's Eleven. I've never seen that. Elven and Chipmunks. Yeah, ETL. <laughs> That's where it belongs. The Age of Turtles. I was talking about the Michael Bay Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I not I don't want to see the Michael Bay Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. No, thank you. Cows. I like cows. It's pretty fun. BTL. DC. So DC EU. So this is DC EU. So we have to go for the all the DC EU movies because DC EU is very very mixed. You know because we have good movies. I movies that I like from the DC EU. So we have Shazam and Aquaman, Wonder Woman. I even like the Justice League movie, but Batman vs. Superman, Birds of Prey, and Suicide Squad do exist, so I'm going to put in CTO. Planet of the Apes, so I've only seen the, re the reboot trilogy, and those movies are just amazing. Those movies are amazing. Jurassic Park, 1 is amazing, 2 is good, 3 is amazing, 4 is amazing, and then the 5th one. We don't talk, it's like, it's like Rocky, we don't talk about it, okay? But Jurassic Park goes in STO, okay? Brian Nemo, both of them are pretty good movies. Brian Weedle and Brian Doyle are both pretty good. Pokemon, oh, oh yes, Pokemon. Okay, we're going to include all the original Pokemon. I liked Rod Dillard like Jim and I was a kid, but I wouldn't really say the good movies, okay? Pikachu was pretty good, so I'll put it in CTO. Pirates of the Caribbean, yeah, not my favorite movie series. I've seen, like, the first one, and that's it. <laughs> first two. <laughs> Indiana Jones, first one, third one, are amazing. Second one, we don't talk about that one. And the fourth one, we don't talk about that one. So, ATO. Madagascar, ATO. Very entertaining and good movies. And the Spickle with me, well, putting it in 
one was good, two was good, and then they started, you know, milking that cast cow. They're making another Minions, another typical me that I'm probably never going to see because they're all the same movies. So, CTL. So, that is all of the movie franchises as well. I don't know if they're missing any other franchises, but they're probably not. Yo, but yep, that's basically it. Goodbye.